Yo guys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, Rambinos, little nigglets. What's going on? This is Rambi here. And today I'm talking all about the new patch for Call of Duty Black Ops 2, of course. And uh, some of you guys um, are really hit, are feeling it hard. Um, feeders, wink wink, uh, Dom feeders, and uh, anybody else who just feeds the trick shotters really aren't getting it too bad um, they don't really have to do much because I mean it doesn't really, you know uh, the rate of fire anyway I'm getting ahead of myself I'm gonna go ahead and give you a little background information so I can get into my story and tell you guys how I feel I'll give you all some perspective um, I've been free for all feeding for a while now uh, probably about four months mainly black ops 2 that's where I've hit most of my clips anyway, so about four months now I've been uh, free for all feeding and um, y uh, yesterday I get on, you know, pop in the disc, go uh, go to start the game, it prompts me for an uh, uh, update, so you know, I'm not really expecting anything too much. I update, I go to playing, and uh, I'm kind of hoping that maybe they reduce the KSG range or... Uh, you know, uh, balanced out some of, you know, the assault rifles, maybe turned off lag or something, I don't know. Just made it better and more balanced. So I go in, I start playing some free-for-all. The first thing I notice is that I'm canceling my reload relatively easy. Like, it, it almost as if, you know, I was doing it on, on accident. So every time I'd shoot, i cancel my reload, and I'm thinking, okay, well, you know, my controller's been a little screwed up lately, so it's definitely not anything too serious. I keep playing, I keep playing, and eventually it just gets worse. And so I'm thinking, okay, I'm done, my controller is retarded. So I switch controllers, same thing. I switch my other controller, same thing. And at this point, I'm extremely ticked off. Uh, I've been getting screwed over by this like constantly wh since I've started playing free for all, but probably about an hour now. So I I'm done. I'm done playing. I get on Skype. I uh, read through most of my Skype messages, and I'm in my verse sniping chat. And I read through some of the messages, and I think it was maybe uh, verse KJ or uh, one of our GFX artists, and they were talking about the patch. I read it in depth, and what? What we obviously know by now is that the rate of fire for the ballista and the DSR has been reduced. And I think it's like one or two notches. It says slightly reduced. If you go to the website and read the uh, patch updates that they always post, it, I think it's like it says slightly reduced. But if you go to the stats of the guns, it like reduces the bar or the little notches by maybe one or two. I'm not sure. But guys, this is a b huge deal. One, it's extremely noticeable. Um, even, f even not not even just for free for all feeders, but for regular feeders. Um, and it's really annoying, obviously, which is why a lot of people have been making a commentary already complaining. And we, you know, we rightfully have that, you know, privilege to complain about it because it affects us a lot. So, what this really means for regular feeders and for free for all feeders is that anything over a quad is going to be exponentially more difficult unless there's a collat somewhere involved in the feed that's highly unlikely for free for all obvi for obvious reasons and for regular feeding well it might not affect you too much if you're not going to use the DSR as much so you know that that kill the kill feed is still the same it's just the fact that you're not shooting in rapid succession quite as much so it's going to be a lot more difficult. It's going to be a lot more difficult. And so a lot of people have already went back to Modern Warfare 3. Um, me personally, I'm already on Modern Warfare 3. Like, once I realized how dumb the patch was, I've already switched over. And to put on as a little side note here, I don't know if you guys noticed this, but I find it kind of interesting how FaZe went to Modern Warfare 3 probably last week. And um, now there's this patch for all systems to reduce the rate of fire making it exponentially more difficult like I said to feed I don't know if there's some kind of correlation there I don't know personally I don't know if the patch update list you know details are on the website they they might be I didn't look so I'm not saying there's any you know subliminal kind of controversy here but just an interesting fact that you know they kind of have somewhat of a head start on getting clips already 
you know, before the all the sniping community starts to transfer. But I don't think that everybody's going to quit Black Ops 2, but a lot of people are going to be more mo prone for Modern Warfare 3, and then obviously Ghost is coming out soon. So that definitely isn't too big of a deal, but why did they do this? I don't know. Why didn't they reduce the KSG range or do something else more uh, that made more sense for us? I really don't know, but this is making our job and community a lot more difficult and tiresome, troublesome, whatever you want to say. So this is just my perspective, guys. This is all I really got to say about it. I don't like the patch. A lot of us don't like the patch. None of us really understand why they did it. Uh, we don't agree with it, obviously, and um, I encourage you all to make more commentaries about this so maybe somebody in the Treyarch area will, you know, do something about it. The worst patch patch yet to this date. I think we all can agree on that. But that's about all I have to say. Leave a like on this video if you don't like the patch. And leave a comment on any thoughts you have that are a little different or that you want to discuss. So that's all we have to say for you guys. Uh, it's been Rami. Have a blessed day, guys. I'm out. Peace.